Lonzo came back. Lonzo came back, and um, that there was there, there was a tweet. I sent that. There was yesterday. a tweet. Um, let me find the yo the actual yo Pavy. Okay, okay. The actual tweet. All right, okay, okay. Can I set it up from my perspective, Go just on so how I saw it, right? So basically, um, you know, um, the Lakers game is you know is on. Lonzo dunks the ball. And then it was right after he dunked it, the ball. Lonzo, I think, dunked the ball. <laughs> dunk Lonzo, Lonzo, I think, dunked the ball. With that move and dunked the ball. Lonzo, I think, dunked the ball, and I missed it, right? And then I came back and I saw it on Twitter. And then as I scroll, I see this tweet on our Hoops and Brews uh, um, Twitter, and it's a thread. It says, Lonzo is the ideal point guard you should want to build your team around. I'd honestly take a Lonzo over a Steph Curry. In the first tweet. Second tweet. I never believe in building around score for I mean around score first point guards. I want my point guard to be a pass first point guard because passing is infectious. When you know you're going to get a chance to score, you play better. Second tweet. Third tweet. Obviously, Steph is a better player than Lonzo right now, but projecting into the future and what I think he'll become, I'd rather have that type of guard on my team than a Steph Curry type. The next tweet after that response was what the fuck from michael swander uh and then pavy said i said what i said and then michael responded laugh so out loud so did i and he signed his name the same way we signed it and then from there just, twitter proceeded goes, to destroy yeah, pavy goes, for the past crazy. eight no for the past 16 hours pavy, I mean, defend yourself i still mean what i mean like first of all i just want to say how many times have y'all seen me set have y'all heard me set up here and say yeah he's better than him but i would rather have him on my Team. How much do I say that a lot? I say that a whole fucking lot. Steph is an amazingly great player, but what I project into the future for Lonzo, like when Magic, when Magic says he sees a vision of Showtime, or when Magic says he sees him in Lonzo Ball, I understand what he means when I watch him play. When I'm projecting into the, granted, he's only 19 years old. He has so much to improve upon. But when I'm projecting into the future, I see a 6'6 point guard who can pass, like, basically like Jason Kidd with a little bit of Magic Johnson, but he can shoot. So, like, a taller Jason Kidd, basically, who can shoot. Jason Kidd took... He the, can't shoot right now, though. What are you talking I about? I think he's going to be able he's, to shoot. He's shooting 35% listen, and 30 from the three and 48% from the free throw line. Listen, what are you talking listen. about? Last year in college, he had one of the most efficient seasons in college basketball history. You don't just lose your efficiency and your ability to be able to shoot. I think he's going to eventually know how to I think he's going to eventually shoot somewhere around 40% from three. <laughs> 39 39, 40% from three. Bro, you gotta you gotta chill. Bro. How? You gotta chill. That's actually what I project for him. I think that he's a guy who can go out there and get me on just looking at the season stats and get you about 18, 8, 12, uh, 2.6, and 1.2. At his absolute peak. At his peak. At his absolute peak. I think he's a guy that can go out there and and, and do that for you. I think he has a chance to be. The best pure point guard in the league. Come on, G. Listen, wait, just listen, wait, just listen, just listen, just listen. The best pure point guard in in the um, league, but also one of the best rebounders from the guard spot in the league. I think he's already probably in that category as one of the best guard rebounders in the league at um, point guard. The best passer in the NBA, one of the best passers ever. Like, his vision is crazy. The man's vision is, that shit's insane. And people don't even know how to play with him yet. And also one of the best defensive guards in the league. And he's also 6'6", 210, which is going to be something to handle from like a guard standpoint because that's usually a mismatch. For most teams, that's a mismatch. Your point guard isn't that big, usually. Now we're going to positionless basketball, maybe, but still a lot of teams' point guards are not that big. Every team is not going to have a point guard that's like a Chris Dunn size. And project it into the future. I would rather have Lonzo on my team. Again, I think Michael Jordan is the best player of all time. Of all time. But if I'm building a team, I'm taking LeBron. It's not always about who's the better player. Period. It's not. Now, he might not be as good of an individual player as him. But if I'm building my team, give me him. For instance, um, I think AI is a better player. Than, I think, listen, listen. I think AI is what? a better player than Steve Nash. 
I think AI is a better player than Steve Nash. He done made it further. Steve Nash got two. I mean, um, AI got an um, MVP. He done made it further. He done took his team to the finals. But if I'm building a team, give me Steve Nash. I think Russell Westbrook is a better player than John Stockton. But if I'm building a team, I might take John Stockton. Oh yeah, and I personally think Steve Nash is a better player than AI. So, but but that's neither here nor there. First of all, come on, G. How is Steve Nash better player than AI? How? How? Uh, two MVPs. Uh, 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 five. Uh, fifty. Know. I mean, I'm sorry. Two MVPs. Four to five. 90, no, 50, G. 40 seasons. No. Led G. the league in assists five years. Look at what he's uh, playing with. Look at what AI playing with, bro. No, I don't want to hear that shit. Look I don't want to hear that shit. I don't want to hear that shit. I'm not gonna talk to you about AI versus Steve Nash. First of all, no. Don't. We're not gonna change. The conversation. We're not, the conversation. We not finna steer the ship another way.